Hi everyone, it is an absolutely splendid day for football and we're looking forward to the game. I'm Derek Ray and ready with his tactics board alongside me is Stuart Robson, my commentary partner. And coming right up, live action from the Elita Serie. It's Molde against Bran. Well, Derek, as is always the case, the team that dominates midfield will be the team that controls the flow of the game. And that, for me, is the area that's key today. Well, things tend to go well for them when they play at home. Let's see if it'll be a story of more of the same today, Stuart. Well, 11 wins out of 15 games tells you how good they've been here. They play with great freedom on the ball and defend with urgency when they haven't got it. It's certainly been a winning combination. And this is how the hosts will begin the game today. Well, they're starting with an attacking 4-5-1 formation with three players in advance of two holding midfielders. But it's important that the wide players come in field to join the centre forward at the right time. And this is the initial 11 for the visitors today. Well, it's a 4-3-3 with two out-and-out -out wingers, but they do vary their movement. They give width, but they also make diagonal runs in field when the ball's on the opposite flank. Their performances will be key today. And the game begins. Chance to do damage. Magnus Wolf Eikram. A glorious chance. And a fine stop. Trying to deliver it accurately, and well off target in the end. Good pressure from the defender to put him off. Useful looking ball. Well, the keeper is happy. The bar was there. Well, they've started the game really brightly, and that was so close to taking the lead. Magnus Wolf Eikram. Well, not quite what he wanted to do with the pass. Couldn't hang on to it. Omoi Juanfo. And he saw the situation developing. Well, that is how to run at defenders. He's got to clatter it away. Could be a chance to break here. Magnus Wolf Eikram. Still pushing for the goal that would put them ahead, but not forcing it. Well, that's really sound goalkeeping, not letting the opposition have any scraps. Hey, Stad. 
The outcome is a goal kick here. Hussein Magnus Wolf Eichram decent progress with the ball at his feet a chopping challenge and the referee has got to have a big think about it well the referee saw it as a bookable offence and I think he's got it absolutely right that was a poor challenge you have to say And a bit short with the clearance. And a time for calm on the ball. Well-timed tackle. Firing it towards goal. Oh, really close. Just over the top. It's with Frederick Knudsen. Well, sitting deep like this might be a dangerous game. Useful looking position, you've got to say. Looking for that final pass, looking for the goal that would put them ahead. Nielsen. Chance to finish! And he couldn't bag the first goal of the contest. Well, I can't believe he's missed the target there. That's a poor finish. Well, no surprise there. The hosts have enjoyed most of the possession, but their attacking players lack tempo, invention and goal. Something they need to rectify quickly if they're going to win this one. He's given it straight to the opposition. That is that for the first half here. The teams are ready to have a go at each other again as the second half commences. Hussein. Here's Omoy Juanvo. Possession and patience, the watchwords. That is tackling of the highest order. Disappointing pass. Heystad. Amoy Juanfo. And on the back of that particular challenge, will the referee let the matter rest there? Well, the card is out, and it's yellow. Yeah, it's clumsy and it's late. Definitely a yellow card.
He plays it short. Bjorn back. Good looking ball. Terrific block. Really good reading of the game to win possession back. Omoi Juanfo. Passing it around, looking for the goal that would put them ahead. Pulls it back. This looks promising. He opted for placement, but it didn't happen for him. Well, they are committed to making the substitution here. Moving it nicely. Excellent vision. It has to be. And there is the goal that gives them a well-merited lead. It had been coming. Just look at this again. The combination play in the top third of the field was so precise. And then what a finish. That's been hit with such power and pace. The keeper has no time to react. It's a brilliant strike. One nil then. Into the final 20 minutes. And will it be the leveller? In it goes! To square the game! What a contest this is turning out to be! Well, here it is again, and having got a touch on it, he'll be a little bit disappointed he didn't keep it out. It was a good effort, though. So underway again here on the back of that leveller. Hussein. Fifteen minutes left for play. Decent position. Getting in there to intercept. Untidy on the ball. Magnus Wolf Eikram. Same. Well, he's lost it. Now a decent position. High echelon goalkeeping there. And now a corner. Can they take advantage of it? So deciding to make a personnel change at this juncture. Now sending it in. It hasn't come to very much. 
ultimate assessment of the situation at the back. Hussein. And if you're wondering about added time, two minutes it'll be. Now he must favour the cross. Heistad. Important facet of his play, holding the ball up and waiting for support. And the pressure is on, can he clear it away? And so the referee brings the 90 minutes to an end, all even here.